Okay, let's give you guys some practice. So somehow differentiate this. So just a word of caution. What you've got here is one bubble to the power of another bubble. So what you've got here is one bubble to the power of another bubble. So this bubble here somehow contains x. This bubble here somehow contains x. So um, so this is not the same as this, x to the power of 3. You see, when, when you differentiate this, it's simply uh, 3x squared. It's simply this. You are, you move it down here, but but this is not the same as this because because here you've got a variable to the power of a constant. This one over here you've got a you've got uh, to the power of a, a another variable. So it's not simply a matter of taking this down. Okay, so so be careful with that. And also also here if if you take the natural log of both sides, it's not simply this moving. It's not simply this. Hang on, it's not simply this. Uh, to uh, natural law of uh, it's it's not simply that because what what you're doing here is uh, you're you're thinking of this if if you were to do that then you're thinking of this then then you can uh, if if you were given something like this bracket bracket then you can do that then you can say natural law uh, y equals x over two uh, and then natural law of uh, two uh, Natural log x here, blah blah. Um, if if you were if you were given brackets like this, then yes, you can simply do that. But here here you've got uh, one block multiplying with another block. So uh, so think about it. What you 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 well when given this here, then then you have to imagine this. Um, you have to imagine uh, you have to imagine it to be something like this two, and then maybe x to the power of let's say x here. Um, how how would you how would you um, use the natural log here? Well, he, he, what you've got here is uh, is a, a block multiplying with another block here. So if you want to use the natural log, then you have to do natural log y equals natural log of uh, of two, and then uh, uh, hang on, let me think, and then uh, and then this. Hang on. So so you've got. So you've got uh, you're natural logging the whole thing here, but then you have to use natural log of a b equals natural log of um, or natural log of a plus natural log of b. Then you have then you have to do this natural log of two uh, plus natural log of x to the power of x, and then you can take this out. So well, do whatever you want. Somehow differentiate this. So press pause and have a go. Okay, so to, to do this, um, visualize this thing here as one block multiplying with another block. That's this bit here. And then now from here, natural log both sides, that will then give you this. So now, uh, now, hang on. Now, now, uh, now use, use, uh, now use natural log of a, a, b equals natural log of a plus natural log of b. So, uh, that's this bit here. And then, and then that's this bit here. Okay, so now, now you can take this out. Okay, you couldn't up here, but now, now you could. So now, uh, now that will then take you to this, and then, uh, and then now it's just a matter of differentiating, differentiating this. So uh, this here, remember, this here is a constant, because if if you were to try and understand what this block means, you 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 should default it as an e here. So when you come to translate this this block, you would say e to the power of what gives me two, gives me two. Uh, so so this whole block here is this exponent here, and then this exponent here is going to be a constant. What I'm trying to say is that this here is a constant. It's just a number. So when you differentiate it, 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 it disappears. It's like me asking you to differentiate three. It's a constant. So so differentiating this, it will be zero. Now here you've got one block. Uh, multiplying with another block, so you've got to use a product rule. Uh, imagine this block here as 1 over 2 times x. So when you differentiate this, it's like me asking you to differentiate this. Differentiate it, it will give you 3. Or differentiate this, it will be a half. So so when, when you come to, uh, to differentiate this, you've got to use a product rule. So the product rule is, um, well, differentiate this, it would be 1 over y, uh, because y is a function of x. Uh, you need to stick this dy by dx in here. So now, now use the product rule on this. So uh, differentiate this, leave this alone. So differentiate this, 
leave this alone and then plus and then uh, and then leave this alone and then differentiate this so when you differentiate this in your mind visualize this natural log of the bubble so when you differentiate this it will be 1 over the bubble times the derivative of the bubble itself well the derivative of the bubble itself is is 1 over x and don't forget the bubble is uh, natural log of x so this one here will be natural log of x so when you differentiate this it will then give you this that will then give you this okay so uh, 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 and uh, we'll tidy this up and then uh, that will then take you to here and then now um, now earlier right from the start y was this so uh, sorry y was this so uh, so when you're here you, you want to get dy by dx on its own so times both sides by by y so that so this here was y if you scroll all the way to the top y earlier we said uh, y was this so so uh, so so from here times both sides by y so this here is y and this thing here is uh, is this thing here okay so now uh, now it's just a matter of multiplying this out this times this would then give you would then give you uh, this because the uh, the two cancels out this half and then uh, and then and then uh, this times this that would then give you this and then if you look at this exactly the same uh, exactly the same so we can just say uh, we can just say this take away one so your overall answer would be this okay